What's up guys? Are you looking for a portable device to create smooth panning motion, time lapse or video? Or maybe something that features product turntable automation? If so, what could have been the perfect portable device might just become out of reach. More on that later. Released a couple of years ago, the Serb Genie Mini 2 is highly versatile and has a lot of features. The box is small and compact with a nice cardboard finish. Inside the box you get the Genie Mini 2, a creatively designed flyer that mentions the collaboration between Serp and Manfrotto in creating Serp Lab. According to Manfrotto's website, Serp Lab was created to focus on new product solutions. Talking about new products, have you seen the latest t-shirt and mug designs on our store crayonroshu.com? If not, go check them out and for your first purchase you will get a 10% discount using this code. I haven't found any product mentioned as designed by Surf Lab, so the true purpose of this collaboration seems unclear. You also get a flyer with various warnings, a setup guide, a USB-C to USB-A cable for advanced camera control, a USB-C cable for charging and a microfiber cloth. Starting from the top, the Genie Mini 2 features a quarter inch thread and a quark textured pad for better grip. On the bottom, a large rubber pad ensures an excellent contact surface and the 3 8 inch thread with an included quarter inch adapter provides versatility when attaching the Genie Mini 2 to a tripod. The casing is covered with a smooth rubber that provides good grip and protection during travel. The hardware interface of the Genie Mini 2 includes a 2.5mm plug used to connect the camera link cable for triggering the shutter, a USB-C port for charging or camera control, and a power button. With a weight of around 248 grams, 9.2 centimeters in diameter and 4.6 centimeters in height, the Genie Mini 2 is designed to sit between your camera and tripod. The internal motor and gears of the device enable precise 360 degree panning motion with cameras weighing up to 4 kilograms or 8.8 pounds. Powered by an inbuilt lithium ion battery, the Genie Mini 2 has a battery life of up to 8 hours of time lapse recording and up to 4 hours of video recording. Connecting to the Mini 2 is easy. You press the power button to turn on Bluetooth and when the LED starts flashing, you can connect using the SERP app. To begin setting up a new movement, after tapping create content, you have several options. You can choose from keyframe, time lapse, video, live control, panorama and turntable. Let's create a time lapse. Here we can select from presets with predefined parameters or create a new setup. I will go with GoPro People and change the predefined values. Adjusting the slider will modify the start and end points of the movement. The small camera icon shows the current position of the Genie Mini 2. With the movement set we can adjust the recording time which defines the total duration of the recording the playtime which sets the duration of the final time lapse, the interval between each triggered shot, and lastly the ease in and out for a smoother motion start and finish. With the settings dialed in, I will start the time lapse by tapping the record button. The Genie Mini 2 feature I was most interested in was the turntable option. To use the Mini 2 as a turntable, you need additional hardware. The accessories arrived in a nice round box that contained a flyer, a microfiber cloth, a setup guide, two background discs with an alignment hole in the middle, a 
turntable platform with a base and a shutter extension cable. Both the turntable platform and base are made of metal with the base having a cork textured pad similar to the Genie Mini 2. Attaching these is straightforward as they all use standard quarter inch and 3 8 inch threads. With the attachments in place and after connecting to the Genie Mini 2 as mentioned previously, you can use the predefined movement setup called turntable. In this setup mode, you can select from clockwise or counterclockwise orientations. You can adjust the total number of photos taken after a 360 degree panning motion is complete and the wait time between each image. With your custom settings entered, you can tap the record button to start the movement. These are just two of the several operation modes of the Genie Mini 2. I've been mostly using the turntable feature and I haven't encountered any issues so far. Sadly, after reaching out to Manfrotto to ask about the future availability of the Genie Mini 2, they replied by saying that the entire Genie product line is discontinued and will no longer be available. I don't know why this happened. From my experience, from using the device, the Genie Mini 2 is an excellent accessory for your camera and can be integrated with other SERP products. If more of us reach out to Manfrotto, they might reconsider bringing the Genie products back to market. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out our store crayonroshu.com. Consider becoming a member of this channel. And till next time, take care.